So in this video we will see how to find a text to a text file. First of all, let's go to the location. Location is this. This is a folder. This is a text file. And in this location we want to find a text to a text file. So text will be a hello world. So let's take the location first. The location will be this. That's simple to it. A file of txt. So let's make use of a stream writer class because we are going to write a text to text file. So it will be a writer object. Stream writer. So it will take a parameter as a uh, to a, it will take a parameter as a location of the file and it will pass a boolean value which is true. This basically tells us stream writer class that we want append the file, append a text to the file, not to delete or overwrite some kind of a stuff. We basically want to append, we just don't want to manipulate the existing text in it. We just want to append new lines to it. So after creating this object, let's make use of a method called write line and the text will be hello world. We are going to write down the text file and uh, we have to dispose this object after making use of it. When the job is done, we have to delete it actually. Dispose it. So we just print the message text append it and it's on the application and see what's happening actually. So text append it, let's see. So as you can see, this is our text and uh, one more thing which you can do you can add a check here before writing to a file or uh, while reading to a file because adding a check is a good option or you can add a try and catch block to catch any kind of file because mostly the uh, errors which you counter is during the location or while reading or writing the file so to make sure that file is in that specific location or not or uh, uh, the text which you are going to write which will be written or not because sometimes there is a restriction in accessibility that you can't even write a file so you can add couple of checks here so like to add a checks you can make use of if and else statement so for example if you want to check a file it exists or not you can make use of a method called file.exist which uh, will return a boolean value and if the value is true you can go ahead if the value is false you can just leave the process of writing or reading. So it's pretty much basic. So see you in the next tutorial. Have a nice day.